Hello everyone, Sigmanator here, and welcome to Daymare 1998. Uh, this game originally started out life as a fan remake of Resident Evil 2 using the Unreal Engine 4, but then Capcom came along and said, uh, excuse me, can you stop that because we're making our own Resident Evil 2 remake. So it's been reborn as Daymare. Let's jump right into it. Daymare mode. So if you call yourself a true survivor, if that's the case, face your fears on the hardcore difficulty or beginner. Just a rookie, scared of your own in-game shadow, maybe you'd best start with this. Hmm. Let's go for Daymare mode. I can take on a challenge. Uh, brightness, I think that's fine. Yeah, that all looks fine to me. Confirm. Several hours have gone by since communications with Aegis Laboratory have been cut off. Now two teams of highly trained Hades, Hexacore Advanced Division for Extraction and Search, operatives are called out to investigate. Their mission? To find the missing researchers who seemingly vanished without a trace and retrieve sensitive highly classified materials for a a clandestine branch of the US government. Tasked with gaining access to lower levels of the lab, Special Agent Leave bar Special Agent Leave barges into the second service entrance and it is there that he discovers the security system was has initiated a facility wide quarantine, automatically shutting everyone in and serving as a warning to would be invaders that some kind of experiment has gone horribly, horribly wrong. Sounds quite similar to the first Resident Evil movie, where the Red Queen goes berserk. All that matters on the chessboard are good moves and the actions you take to achieve this result. What I do is bide in the shadows, where I can strategically exploit the most vulnerable pawns. But this time had to be different. This time, I had to involve my hand directly. But let's get things in the right order. So I began the first phase of my plan. Ooh. Requesting the evacuation of all remaining personnel. Code Blue, repeat, this is a Code Blue emergency. Please respond, anyone, please. My name is Rebecca Jordan. I'm a doctor at the Aegis Medical Facility on the North Ball Islands. We have a problem of some magnitude here. There's a situation in the building that requires... There's been a terrible mishap. I, I think we've been exposed to some kind of gas. A corrosive agent that latches onto the lungs, warping people outside. Can anyone hear me? I think she's in trouble. Operation status has been raised to priority 
be our last. Well, you know, if I were a betting man, I think I'd bet that the odds of uh, making it home in one piece are uh, a lot better with you on the battlefield. But that's if, you know, Gomer Pyle doesn't put us down first. Just shut the fuck up, Leaf. Goddamn motor mouth. Don't let him get to you, kid. That shepherd squawks at anyone with a bigger stick. Which is pretty much everyone. Never should have pulled his ass out that fire back in Bloom in 94. Thanks, Hayden. Er, understood, Major. Damn it. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I should just let the past go. Romero Fort Gulf, this is HQ. <laughs> HQ, this is Sandman Actual, in descent for November Foxtrot, India, standing by for a mission go. Sandman Actual, this is HQ, you are mission go, authentication, Echo Gulf 394, at time 0227 Zulu, out. We are mission go, this is the second blast one, and the end of the line for you, lead. Green will infiltrate the laboratory via the third blast one. After that, Raven and I will hold position at the external loading bay. Well, this team don't seem to like each other very much. Not great basis for a teamwork, but there you go. All right. Should be nice and simple to uh, remember. Right, that's punch. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll go with the handgun first. Sprint as well as a jog. Sprint's limited, so I better save that from running away. Sandman to Agent Leave. Judging from the fragments of video we pull from surveillance, it appears that several tanks labeled CSR 3 have already been attached to the main hoisting unit. I'll say I'll stand by at the main doors to the freight elevator. Over. Liev here. Copy that. Objective confirmed. Looks like the contagion leaked out from a couple tanks crammed into the area. There are also sure signs of a firefight and explosive residue. Proceeding with the mission. Over. Alright, so this is what I'm here for. Hello? Guess I've got to get it operational. You not stay down. Ooh, that's not pretty. It's about time you guys got here. You're with emergency response, right? That's right, Agent Liev. How's the leg? Oh, it hurts like hell. But I'll be all right. Can't move very far, though. That's unfortunate. 
Listen, I need to search this place for survivors. I'll come back for you as soon as I can. Survivors? Yeah, well, good luck with that. Anyway, I'll be waiting here. I just need to rest my eyes a little. Cool, you do that. I'll, cu I'll come back when you turn into a zombie. Oh, it's going to make me shoot him. Okay. In order to perform the reloading action, you must first select the magazine. Okay. All right then. Anything else in here? <coughs> oh, excuse me. You right there, buddy? Right, before I go upstairs, let's do an explore. In case I've missed anything. Need to open the roof first. All right, fair enough. Ouch! That could not have been pleasant. Having a metal crate fall on your legs. All right. I don't think there's anything more I can do down here. Control Sandman. I made contact with an Aegis worker. I followed the protocol. I'm now heading to the control room to begin loading procedures. Over. Copy that. This all brings back memories from that before. Especially that day when you opened fire on all those poor innocent people. Or what was left of them. Don't you remember? Orders are orders, Major. And those innocent people weren't exactly civilians. When you finally get your ass out of that chopper and onto the battlefield, we'll talk about it. Proceeding to objective. Over. Alright, so Agent Liev is, uh... He's got a bit of a checkered past by the sounds of it. And he's not one to hold back on following his orders, so... I'm guessing he's loyal to this Hades group. I don't think it, I don't think I'd call this fun. Translated from Japanese, eighth of August, nineteen forty-five. Honor, a word that Allied forces will never understand. Thousands of innocent souls in seconds destroyed by the U.S. atomic bomb. Not those of soldiers. Not those of men who made a choice to fight and sacrifice themselves in service of our great nation. But those of Pacific civilians who lived in the cities now totally cancelled. Women and children. Our families are gone, obliterated by their desire for dominance, by the desire to show the world the strength of their science, the atomic bomb. But now the time has come to show them the strength of our science. It took years of hardship to develop terrible weapons, but the worst, yeah, but the worst we could imagine arrived simply by chance. We had chosen to keep the scourge, our worst discovery, a secret because it was too inhumane, too inhuman even for Unit 74, where men were granted the luxury of releasing the darkness of their spirits. A weapon too inhuman even for war, but not too inhuman for those Western people who lost all traces of honour with the push of a button. The men of this crew, the fathers and sons now deprived of their loved ones, have renamed it Shujin, the condemnation. The condemnation. Condemnation. God, English is hard. The world literally works 
and histories will remember the people behind the atomic bomb as villainous and blatant, a mass genocide that will tarnish their conscience forever. But this is not enough, not for us, not for the families they cancelled in one second. Perseverance is better than defeat. The new emperor ordered that Xu Jin be spread over the enemy, a divine, noiseless wind, but extremely lethal. A condemnation will tear their hearts out and lead them on the path to the same suffering we are experiencing. We departed from Tokyo a few hours ago and expect a long journey to the American coast where the plague will be unleashed, and a story out of their science fiction novels will run its course. At this very moment, a second, a second I-400 of the glorious Japanese Imperial Navy should be leaving Osaka, ready to deliver the second and last reserve of the plague to a top-secret location in Germany. Unit 74 no longer exists, swept away by a 20 kiloton blast, but its creation is more alive than ever, and it could still shift the balance of power in the world in our favour. We must do everything we can and leave the rest to fate. The rest is illegible. Ooh, someone's got a bit of a grudge on. Looks like some of these people have been eaten already. So are these zombies aren't having a nap? What's going on? Need to restore the power first. Oh, guess what's going to happen when I restore the power? I'm hearing noises. Health system. Rapid use quick shop. Press B. In order to use an item, you must first select it from the quick shop. Hold down the use item. Alright, okay then. An energy bar. Definitely need one of those. Yep, yeah, no, that's fine. I thought I came in this way, but I didn't. Check status. Alright. Status is fine. Oh. Auto save. Something's about to go down. Anything in here? Hi there, friend. Looks like a blank transaction made out to Jay Phelps for one million dollars. Hmm. Ammo. I read your file, Kevin, and your resume is quite impressive. Despite your age, it seems you've already installed and maintained your share of sophisticated equipment that most techs here don't even know exist. Now, I'm not trying to scare you, but I want you to know exactly what you're getting into. I heard you asked a co-worker what kind of research is being conducted here. If I had to hazard a guess... It must involve the UFO they found off the coast of this island. These scientists are clearly seeking ways to permanently alter the human genome to create superhuman alien hybrids. Joking, obviously, but this is a top secret government facility and the suits here won't hesitate to lock you up and throw away the key if you give them reason to. Places like this naturally employ state-of-the-art computer systems and machinery that go well beyond the scope of most technicians. Lucky for you, the thermoelectric generators although extremely powerful, are very simple to use via an interface. The only real, real hurdle you will come across is the odd time when a power outage occurs. In this situation, all you need to do is find a PC to check which area is shorted out, as indicated by a flashing red dot. That's very handy. 
Unfortunately, the repair process isn't automatic, so you have to restore power manually using the control panel to bypass the areas marked in red, which will turn green if you are successful. Just follow the instructions on screen and I'm sure there won't be any problems, but if you run into something serious, give me a call and I'll send someone down to help you. Don't forget that don't forget that loose lips sink ships. Welcome aboard and good luck. Mikko Hagen, Chief Maintenance Officer. All right. right. They're all red. C D O F D A H E. Right. Right. C D O F. No, maybe I'm wrong. Alright, I've had another look around and there's no other items for me to pick up or files to find. So it's got to be... Apparently I have enough information to do this puzzle, but I do not. One eternity later. God, that was... Oh, hello? Well, hello! What the hell are these things? That'd be a zombie. I'm guessing it's dead as it's bleeding out. Well, it was trial and error, but we got there in the end. That leaflet that I read about it was not helpful whatsoever. But anyway, power is restored. Oh, and it shut the doors. Oh, I recognise that sound. That was taken out of Resident Evil 2. drop anything? No. I'm expecting a lot of Resident Evil 2 Easter eggs, or Resident Evil in general, considering the uh, Oh, hello love. there before pretty sure right I can now turn you on power failure detected start recovery process yes right now I just need to get back there and flip that switch what could possibly go wrong Shit! Oh. oh, fucking controller! 
Oh yeah, of course I died. My controller disconnected. For fuck's sake. Oh, god damn it. Oh, piss off, game. Two shots. Just need to. Why are all the lights off? Is it me or the light? All the lights off? Because I'm pretty sure this was all lit up earlier. go back and oh you do drop stuff some of you do anyway go back and make sure the power is turned on because it's a bit dark here like okay and that's still saying that but that's all okay Fair enough. Oh, it's because I haven't got my flashlight on. Idiot. This time, oh, so Agent Lee, Sandman here. The external bulkheads are opened up. Uh. Head back to the cargo bay and activate the freight elevator from there. Over. Yeah. Dead. Thank you. Did you leave me anything? Oh no, because you're not dead. <laughs> All right. You're dead now, aren't you, bitch? All right. How many of these things are we have to? Am I going to have to deal with when we get right to the thing? something down below. It looks like a huge submarine with markings that resemble biohazard symbols and could the flag really be Japanese? Focus on the mission, Agent. I don't care what titter-ridden cow curdles the milk those pasteurizing big shots call us in to mop up. Time is running out. Get your ass on the objective. Over. Ooh, interesting. Oh, it's the helicopter I could hear. Hi, right, boys. Shit.
activate this. Oh, hello. Die, thank you. DF to mission control. Elvis has left the building. Dead yet? Shit, I remember. Right, okay then. Right, let's take out these two and then see where what's going on from here. Taken care of. Oh, there's the third one. Bollocks. Stop missing your dick. She's not a good idea. I'll just do. Cover box. Do a sneak attack. <laughs> Shit. Get off. I'm pressing A. You are one ugly motherfucker. Right, get up to. Go around him. Well, that was difficult. Doesn't help that I was wasting ammo. Alright, they can't come through. Right, I'm going to end this first episode here because I clearly don't know what the hell I'm doing. So far, I'm intrigued. This is the kind of game that's usually right up my alley, so hopefully it will hold out. I don't know what those three reindeers in the top screen are for, but we'll find out as we progress. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and be sure to ding the bell icon to stay notified of any future uploads. I've been Sigma Later, this has been Daymare, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.